Hello, my name is Jackson, and today I'm going to be providing you a brief overview of how to use all the features on Check-In with Merits. To start off, navigate to checkinwithmerits.com. If you are an administrator of a verified organization on Merit, then you can click this Link with Merit button to get started. If you are an admin for multiple organizations, here you can select which one you would like to edit the activities and check-ins for. This brings you to the main Check-in with Merits interface. The sidebar on the left shows you different options. The question mark icon will show you an overview of how to get started with Check-in with Merits. You can click on each box for more information. The home button will show you an overview of all of the check-ins for your activities. This is also called the analytics dashboard. It will summarize the number of individual check-ins, the total hours logged, number of unsuccessful check-ins from people who did not meet an activity's qualifications, and the number of people who have not checked out of activities. A cumulative summary is shown at the top, and the numbers are broken down by activity below that. You can filter the results by activity, and the summary at the top will update for whatever activities are shown in the breakdown section. You can also filter by date. You can click the export button in the top right to download a spreadsheet that shows all of the individual check-ins that are summarized in this view. The activities page shows all of the activities or events that you have created for your organization for people to check into. You have the option to create new activities or edit existing ones. The check-in log shows all the recent check-ins for your organization's activities. You can manually check someone in by selecting Check-in Participant in the upper right and entering their info. You can check someone out by clicking the Checkout button in the Checked Out column. You can edit someone's check-in time by clicking on it. You can select multiple records using the checkboxes on the left. This allows you to check out multiple participants at once by using the checkout button. You can send merits to participants by clicking the three dots in a record and choosing send merit, or by selecting multiple records and clicking send merits. This will bring up a selection box that includes all of the merit templates in your organization. You can filter the results by activity using the filter on the right. You can export all these results as a spreadsheet using the export button. The qualifications section allows you to set up merit qualifications that participants will be required to meet in order to check in to a particular activity. The Forms section allows you to create forms that you would like to attach to activities. Participants who are checking into these activities will be prompted to complete these forms. Finally, the Kiosk section gives you instructions for how to set up a check-in kiosk using the Check-in with Merits tablet application. And this concludes our overview of the various features of CheckInWithMerits.com. Please reference the other videos for more in-depth tutorials on the individual sections. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at help at gomerits.com or visit us at merits.com slash knowledge. Thank you.